What's up guys, it's Ryan, and today I'm back with some more Pokemon Unite Ranked Play. Now, before I jump into it, let me just explain how all of this works, because I'm sure a lot of you don't play the game. So, Ranked Mode consists of six levels, Beginner, Great, Expert, Veteran, Ultra, and Master. Master being the top, which is the one that I'm trying to get to, because once you get there, it tells you where you're ranked in the world, and I think that's just really cool. So, as you can see, I'm currently Expert Class 4, and what class means is... Every ranking, whether it's beginner, grade, expert, they all have classes from about one to five. And once you pass five, you move up to the next level, the next rank. So my dilemma is that I've been stuck in expert for what feels like forever. I just can't get out. Maybe that means I'm bad at the game, but I actually think I'm pretty good. I think the problem is that I'm doing solo queue, which again means that I'm not playing with friends. I'm just playing with random people online and that makes it very difficult. I can't communicate with my team properly. Sometimes I just get people who don't really know how to play the game and that happens more often than it should. So usually I, I win a game, I lose a game, I win a game, I lose a game. It's rough. Now, if you look at my rank and my class, you can see that there are three diamonds. What those diamonds mean is every time you win a game, you gain one diamond. And when you lose a game, you lose one diamond. So when I'm winning and losing, I'm kind of just going nowhere. And that's pretty much where I've been for the last about week or two. All right, so that's my brief explanation of how ranked works. Now let's just jump into it. All right, so as you can see, I'm playing Snorlax. And while I love Snorlax, there's a reason why I'm playing him. And that's because every team consists of different roles. There's attacker, defender, support, speedster. And usually when I've been playing, I would be playing more of an attacker all-rounder role, but I noticed that no one would ever pick the defender. No one wanted to be the defender. So. Because of that, I felt like I was losing a lot of games, especially considering Snorlax is one of the best characters in the game. So, if you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. As Snorlax, I usually want to go up into the top lane. Now I just chose Tackle. Oh, it didn't go through. Okay. Now my job as Snorlax, I don't want to be getting the last hit on any of these enemies. But the last hit means is that whoever gets the last hit gets the most experience from that. Oh my god, I just got the last hit. Okay, I'm totally blowing it. Okay, but what the last hit means is that whoever gets the last hit gets the most experience from that wild Pokemon. And I typically want my attacker to be getting all of that experience. And maybe that didn't work out so well right here, but it's okay. Now at eight minutes and 50 seconds is when these bees spawn. And we wanna be able to take the bees as quickly as possible so that the enemy team can't get any of that experience, which we just successfully did, so that's great. So right now, what just happened now is very important. I'm going to be rotating from the top lane to the bottom lane because something called Dreadnought just spawned. Dreadnought is like a turtle looking Pokemon. And when we take down Dreadnought, we get a ton of experience, a ton. And that puts our team significantly ahead. It's very important. We're doing phenomenal. We just won that team fight and now we're most likely gonna be taking Dreadnought. So my job as a defender is I wanna make sure that the enemy team doesn't get anywhere near my team as they're fighting Dreadnought. But it looks like they... All right, so they all just backed off and that is a huge issue. So this is where all the problems with the uh, solo queue comes from. I put my team in a perfect position to take Dreadnought and they all just ran away instead. So now it looks like we're actually going to lose Dreadnought, which is a huge problem. I'm going to keep pinging for them to come help me, but I'm sure they won't. This is big. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to hide here in this grass, and I'm going to try to steal Dreadnought. I think I stole it. Did I steal it? I stole it. All right, nice. That's how this works. That is why I am great with Snorlax. You get that nice little sneaky steal, hiding in the grass. They do all the work, and I did it. Didn't even need my team. I hope they don't steal the Zapdos right now, but I think, yeah, okay, we got it. I don't know where the enemy team is. I guess they're all at their base right now. This game is pretty much in the bag. Oh, 812, nice. All right, so there you go. That's one game win right there. And hopefully we can get some more. I, at least, so obviously there's a long way to go to Master, and I'm not going to get there in this video, but my goal for this video is to at least get to Veteran finally. If I can do that, I will be so happy. Yeah, so that last game right there is exactly why I play Snorlax. If you have a good Snorlax play on your team, you can really secure a win. Like, 
as you saw when I stole that Dreadnought at Snorlax, I think that was huge for my team. And even when Snorlax isn't leveled that high, his block ability, that where I make that wall and push them away and it stuns them, is probably the, if not one of the strongest moves in the entire game. Yeah, we're getting triple teamed in top lane already, so... The other team's doing something wrong. Yeah, we just wiped their whole team. Steal one of their berries. Alright, maybe this game will actually be okay, because they're not playing correctly, so... Um, yeah. We're doing great. Let's get this Dreadnought, let's do it, Snorlax! Uh... Take out this Talon Flame. Nice. Pikachu. You ain't going nowhere, Pikachu, you ain't going nowhere! None shall pass! Nice. Wall them off. Uh, oh no, 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 no. Cinderace, 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 finish it, finish it. Yes, yes. Oh, whoo. Okay, hopefully I can respawn and turn it in time. I don't think so, but if they can all score, we're good. I think I'll just sit here and defend. We're ahead. Yeah, we're, we're fine, we're fine. I'll make sure they don't score. That is my job, I'm the defender. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh, stop him, stop him, stop him. Ah, ah, ah! Alright, we're good. Woo! That was a little scary there at the end, but we're good. Nice. Alright. Let's do this. Same strategy. Don't steal it, don't steal it. Nine tails, don't steal it. Okay, we're good. Where'd Froki go? What is he what is he doing over there? Okay. My guy, come down here. Come down here. Finish this one. I'll do it. Over here. Right, and surprise attack! Boom! Oh, we're killing this Absol. Okay, nice. And we're killing his Ninetales after he scores too. Yeah, no, 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 no. No, no. No, you don't. I'm gonna sneak in here and score. Because I have a scoring shield and he can't do anything about it! Uh, Absol's in our jungle though. What is he, what's he, what you doing? And that is why the wall is great. Gather here, friends, gather here. Absol's almost dead. Ninetales dead. Slow bro. Dead? Oh, let's do this team! Alright, I'm hyped. My team is good. We got that. Sick. That's how you hold them off. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out! Ah, ah, ah. Uh, all right, hopefully my team can, can pull through right there. Oh, I think they did. They just cleared them. Yeah, okay. Oh, that, sure. But you know, I was the real MVP there because I walled their team off until my team came back for reinforcements. So good job, me. Did we only turn one in? Can I sneak this? I can sneak this. Oh, nice. We stopped that. Okay, okay. That might have been huge. 20 seconds left. Nine tails is coming. 
Nine Tails is not going anywhere. Grey Wall with Snorlax. You're not escaping. I'm gonna get this kill. Ooh. Didn't get the kill, but that's fine. I think we did it. Ooh. It was that last turn in by me. That for all oh, that 80 points. I knew it. I knew I needed that. Sneaky Snorlax. That's how we do it. Oh, so right here, when my performance points is 200, I get an extra diamond. So now, I just need one more win to get the better in. One more. Okay, so I'm super nervous about my team composition right now. I don't think Mr. Mime is very good. Gardevoir is really good, but not good until like the end of the game. So, yeah, Absol's the worst speedster. Wigglytuff got a buff, so Wigglytuff is pretty good now, but man. I need this win to finally make it to Veteran, and I'm not so sure right now. Who's coming top with me? Please. Please. Nobody's coming top with me. The Ralts is actually AFK. Oh my god. This is this is a disaster. Oh now it's coming. Okay, okay, please, please, please. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Please get the Dreadnought. Please. Gather here. Please. Yes, yeah, Snorlax does need backup. Thank you, Wigglytuff. Come down here. Stop fighting pointless team fights. Come down here. Come down here. I'm not strong enough to take it down on my own. I'm a defender. Uh. Yeah, let's take down the Cinderace. Okay. All right. We'll take it. We'll take it, Wigglytuff. Let's go. Absol's here. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Go, 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 go. Team. Teamwork. 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 That's right. Guys. Uh, why does my team insist on making me fight alone? I feel like I always get 3v1 because my team just doesn't care about me. I don't think we're winning. I don't remember what the last thing said. It might have said it was a close battle. Maybe if the Guard of War can score this point right now. Sure. Oh? Okay. Okay. Can we stop Lucario? Mime? Mime? Yes, okay. You know what? Sure. Maybe, maybe we did win. Who just scored? Oh no. Talonflame just scored. Oh wait, 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 maybe we won. Maybe we won. 496. Do we did it! We did it! We won! We won! Yes! 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 Veteran! Veteran tier! Here we come! Ah, uh, you know, I had my doubts. I thought my team wasn't doing what they were supposed to, but somehow I guess they made it work. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Finally. Two weeks in the making. <sighs> Veteran. Veteran. Oh, feels so good. Oh my god, finally. Finally, you don't understand how frustrating this has been for me. Just win, lose, 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 win, lose. And now, I finally made it to Veteran. There's still a long way to go. I still have to get out of Veteran to Ultra and from Ultra to Master. And that is going to be super difficult. Especially because the higher in the tiers I go, the more intense level the play gets. I just really got to play with some friends. I... My group of friends don't don't play consistently enough and for the most part I just end up solo queuing because I just want to play the game and uh, this feels good. Alright guys, well, thanks for watching me finally make it to Veteran Tier. I'm glad I was able to do this on camera. Oh look, a friend just came on Pokemon Unite. Tyler, Tyler, where were you the whole time? Alright, well, again, thank you for watching guys and thanks for watching me finally get to Veteran Tier. I'll hopefully be making more of these videos if you guys keep enjoying it and watch me climb all the way up to Master, see where I rank in the world, and maybe, just maybe, I can get to number one. It's gonna be very hard, but maybe I can do it. All right, maybe like top 100, thousand, top, not 100,000, top 1,000. 
that's my first goal. All right, get to, you know, no, scratch that all. My first goal is to get to master. From there, we'll see what happens. But thanks for watching for the third time. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.